Howdy, Earthlings. You've joined me on my journey through the night skies of Texas, but today it's all about a momentous event that's just around the corner, the total solar eclipse on Monday, April 8th, 2024. So what's so special about this upcoming eclipse? Why is it an event that you won't want to miss? Stick around because we're about to dive into the heart of it, exploring the path of totality, key locations, and all the tips and tricks you need to make this eclipse adventure unforgettable. Total solar eclipses are a remarkable result of an extraordinary celestial alignment. It all starts with three key players, the sun, earth, and the moon. Our sun, a dazzling star, lights up our days. The moon, our trusty satellite, orbits our planet. And earth, our home, is where the celestial spectacle unfolds. Every so often, the moon positions itself precisely between the sun and the earth. The moon's shadow, called the umbra, falls onto our planet. When this alignment is perfect, it creates a total solar eclipse. It's like the moon saying, Hey sun, mind if I borrow your spotlight for a moment? And for a brief period, it does just that. During a total solar eclipse, the moon completely covers the sun. The sky darkens, and in that moment, something incredible happens. The sun's outer atmosphere, known as the solar corona, becomes visible, a halo of wispy, ethereal light that's nothing short of mesmerizing. Now that we've unraveled the cosmic secrets behind total solar eclipses, let's talk about something equally important, the path of totality. The path of totality is a shadowy trail that stretches across the landscape where the moon's shadow touches the Earth's surface. The path of totality isn't a one-size-fits-all phenomenon. It varies in width, typically ranging from about 50 to 70 miles wide. And here's the kicker. The closer you are to the center of this path, the longer the total eclipse will last. Now let's talk about some standout locations within this path. If you're ready to chase totality, here are a few places that promise an unforgettable eclipse experience. Austin, Texas. Our very own Liberty Hill is on the edge of totality, but consider venturing to nearby Austin for a more central view. Dallas-Fort Worth, Texas. A short drive from Liberty Hill, these cities offer great eclipse watching options. Little Rock, Arkansas. Nestled within the path, Little Rock promises a fantastic view. Indianapolis, Indiana. If you're up for a road trip, India is right in the path and could make for a memorable eclipse destination. Cleveland, Ohio. For a northern perspective, Cleveland provides an excellent vantage point. Choosing your location wisely is a game changer when it comes to witnessing totality. Remember, the center of the path offers the longest and most dramatic eclipse experience. But how do you plan your eclipse trip to make sure you're in the right place at the right time when the big day arrives? That's where planning your eclipse trip comes into play. One of the first things to consider is checking the weather. Eclipse day isn't just any day. You'll want clear skies for the best viewing experience. Next, let's talk gear. Make sure you have your eclipse glasses or solar viewers ready to protect your eyes during the partial phases. Safety should always be a top priority. Here's a handy checklist to keep in mind as you plan your eclipse trip. Check the weather. Stay updated with eclipse weather forecasts for your chosen location and nearby backup spots. Prepare your gear. Ensure you have the necessary eclipse glasses or solar viewers for everyone in your group. Travel timing. Plan your travel to arrive at your chosen location well in advance. Eclipse day traffic can get busy. Now that you've planned your eclipse trip, it's time to talk about capturing the magic of the celestial spectacle. Whether you're a seasoned photographer or just starting, here are some tips to make sure you don't miss a beat. First and foremost, ensure you have the right equipment. A good camera with manual settings, a sturdy tripod, 
and most importantly, a solar filter designed for your camera lens are essential. Before the big day, practice shooting the sun, with proper safety precautions, of course. Experiment with exposure, shutter speed, and ISO settings to find the perfect balance. Manual mode can only get you so far, so familiarizing yourself with the advanced features of your camera and practicing using them can make the difference between a good photo and a great one. When it comes to eclipse photography, timing is everything. You want to capture the phases of the eclipse, the partial phases leading up to totality, the breathtaking moments of totality itself, and the partial phases after. Know the eclipse schedule for your location and plan your shots in advance. Keep in mind that lighting conditions will change rapidly during the eclipse. And remember, safety first. Never look at the sun through your camera's viewfinder without proper protection. Use your camera's live view mode or an electronic viewfinder to compose your shots. After you've captured your eclipse photos, the real fun begins in post-processing. Software like Adobe Lightroom or Photoshop can help you enhance and refine your images. Bring out the intricate details of the solar corona and create stunning visual effects. Here are a couple of my pictures from the October 2023 annular eclipse. It was partly cloudy in my location, and I was able to use that to create stunning contrast with the eclipse. If you're feeling ambitious, consider creating a time-lapse video of the eclipse. Set your camera on a tripod and take a series of photos at regular intervals. When stitched together, these images create a mesmerizing visual story of the eclipse's progression. And there you have it, fellow Earthlings. We've journeyed through the cosmic wonders of total solar eclipses, from understanding the celestial alignment planning your eclipse adventure, and capturing the magic with your camera. But remember, a total solar eclipse isn't just a scientific phenomenon. It's an emotional experience that leaves a lasting impact on those who witness it. The moments leading up to totality, the eerie darkness during those precious minutes, and the return of the sun, all of these create an unforgettable memory that stays with you forever. Hit the comments below and tell me all about your past eclipse experiences and all about your plans for the April 8th total eclipse. As we approach the eclipse, I encourage you to take every safety precaution seriously. Ensure you have the right gear, especially certified eclipse glasses or solar viewers. If you don't have access to safety gear or just want a more interactive experience, be sure to join the Texas Dark Skies Total Eclipse live stream on April 8th starting at 11.30 a.m. Central Standard Time, live from Liberty Hill, Texas. See you then. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, smash that like button. Click that subscribe button for more content from Texas Dark Skies, and ding that notification bell to get notifications when new videos are posted. Take care of yourselves, and then in the words of my favorite personal astrophysicist, keep looking up.